Emily Blunt and John Krasinski will restore your faith and love. Pleasant pairs come in first, that's the takeaway from Emily Blunt and John Krasinski, who were married in 2010 after dating since 2008. Both Krasinski, 44, and Blunt, 41, have achieved enormous success independently and jointly, having worked together on the A Quiet Place film series. However, the parents of two young girls are equally well known for their extreme sweetness for one another. I wasn't really looking for a relationship. And then I met her, and I was so nervous, I was like, oh, God, I think I'm going to fall in love with her, Krasinski said on The Ellen Show in 2011 shortly after getting married. As I shook her hand, I went, I like you, so if anyone's looking for a way to pick up a girl, that's the way to do it. But what are the details of how this seemingly perfect couple got together? Let's take a trip down the blunt Krasinski memory lane, starting with his devotion to one of her films 2006, John Krasinski goes wild for The Devil Wears Prada. It's become almost legendary that Krasinski went bananas for the 2006 comedy starring Anne Hathaway, Meryl Streep and his future wife. When he finally met Blunt, who plays Emily, one of Miranda Priestly's dutiful fashion assistants, she asked him how many times he'd seen the film. Like 75 times, he told Glamour in 2016. I'm lucky enough that she stayed with me and didn't realize that she had really married her stalker. 2008, fate brings them together in a restaurant. While at dinner with his pal Justin Thuru, Krasinski spotted Blunt and a mutual friend at a nearby table, and headed over, as Blunt recalled on Late Night with Seth Meyers in 2018. I was in a restaurant. He was in the restaurant. I was sitting with a mutual friend, Blunt said. He abandoned Justin and came over to talk to us. He did not eat. He just stood there and made me laugh. For their first date, the two ate pizza at Krasinski's apartment in West Hollywood. They shared in a joint 2018 interview with The Hollywood Reporter. That night, something happened between them that was so precious Blunt declined to share details. In 2022, Blunt noted on The Late Show with Stephen Colbert that she still has the royal blue velvet jacket she wore that night, even though, in her words, it was an awful jacket. I wore it on John and I's first date, and I have not thrown it out, she said. It's such an awful jacket. It sits there, and I go, that is a terrible jacket.